Why does my cat hiss at my new cat? Well, I get this question asked to me quite a lot. I take in uh, quite a lot of cats monthly. I foster many, many cats and I do expect them to get on in the end. Not at the beginning, but at the end, I do expect them all to get on. If we're gonna live together, then we need to work a way of getting around the situation where they get along. And it's simple really, it's just about understanding cats. Cats are not like humans, so you can't just chuck them straight in and expect them to start talking and getting on and having a laugh and cuddling up to each other. It doesn't work like that. Cats um, that already live in your home for a long time uh, see their house or your home as their territory and they will mark it. They will hiss and they will growl at the new arrival. So um, an easy way to do this is to create a new cat let the old cat have a sniff of the new cat every day. Let the, let the old cat get used to the new cat. The smells are going to be different. The, the new cat's going to bring in some new smells from the streets, from the outside. All these smells that the cat hasn't smelt for such a long time. Your old cat is used to certain things in the home, certain smells, uh, a routine. So you will be upsetting this and, and your old cat will feel stressed and will feel threatened. You need to let them get on um, day by day. This could take a few weeks. It could even take a month. It, it just depends on how you put your time into getting them used to each other. It's important that they don't fight it out. Don't let them fight it out. It will only cause negativity and it will give a bad feeling to your old cat and it will stick in their brain and they will just see the, the new cat as a threat. And every time they see that cat, they will just charge for it. So basically, when you know that they've started to accept each other, they will start to just slowly touch each other's noses, brush up against each other. This is just kind of showing um, that they've accepted each other and that they're happy for them to be around and contact is no problem. The next step is they will start to lick each other and clean each other. This is a really good sign. This is a good sign of friendship. This is a good sign of accepting each other completely. Uh, sleeping with each other, licking each other, grooming each other. It's such a lovely, lovely thing to see once they've got to this stage. So just take your time um, and just follow the instructions and just let cats be cats. And you'll see that in their own time they will work it out and they will eventually get on.